hello friends you're welcome to this new video of power bi today in this video i'm going to tell you about how you can make a customized button that will help you to export power bi data to csv suppose in a scenario if a client wants that in your uh, dashboard that there is a table for an example i have taken here a dummy data where site wise sales is given there let's say client wants a customized button there you are seeing that will export the data to csv and automatically send to their email so let's see how this works if i click over this export to csv button this will automatically trigger you are seeing this is triggering and if i check over my email you will see that i received an email here directly but currently the file is not attached here but similarly it will work so let's understand how we can make this button but before starting the video if you are new to the channel please subscribe the channel and hit the like button so let's start so first of all i am removing this <coughs> button here and to do this so uh, one thing is uh, i need to tell you here the data will be in form of csv or excel in, uh, i mean to say in a table form of a table right pie chart on uh, if you think uh, a pie chart or a bar chart will send not this is for the table so if you know about this visual power automate we will use this visual here so simply i'll click here and this button originates and in this power automate play you simply add the fields which basically client wants right so for example i'll put here site name and the gi value and iv msu and all this right so suppose i want these values and this table what you can do you can simply click on this power automate and add the fields which you want to be sent to the directly client in form of a table so i put that values and one more thing you can do you can just simply copy this table and paste here and convert this table into power automate right so you you are seeing all the fields are there right perfect so this data i have to send to the client deal uh, i need to provide a button that if a client click over there it will automatically send this data to their email or multiple emails so you are seeing this three dot click on the edit button here and you are seeing a power automate options here so i'm going to make a new flow here so it's loading let's wait uh, till it's loading okay perfect so these three flows i have already made but i'll tell you how you can do if you are new to the power automate you just simply click on the new here and you have to choose instant cloud flow right so click on there instant cloud flow yeah so this is a power bi button clicked right so let's first i name it to uh, export to cs csv so i have given a flow name there and this is a default power bi button clicked and below of that you are seeing there new step right you have to add some steps here that will run a flow now you are seeing this a pop up will appear here right so in this option you have to type create csv so you have to go with this op data operation create csv table when i click this table now it's asking count so there are multiple uh, parameters there user id username timestamp and uh, power bi so just click over there power bi data so when you click uh, power bi data it basically uh, taken the power bi data which is in the flow of this uh, visual basically the fields which i have added this all these all the uh, fields it will take right so <coughs> perfect we're done so this is step actually create a csv table uh, basically based on this data this fields i have added there so now click on next step so next step is to send this data to an email automatically so uh, what you can type here 
send email so there are multiple options but you have to go with the send email uh, outlook v2 you can type outlook or email so click on the send email v2 over here now you have to specify there the emails which you want to send this data so i am putting here my email this and you can also uh, type multiple uh, emails here if you want to send two to three four five ten nine many people you can type here and simply uh, you can type the subject here uh, i let's say i'm typing sales data right uh, let's say daily sales data clients want a daily report of this data when the cloud be refresh right now come to the body uh, like uh, what you want to specify in the body so i am i i specify here uh, let's say please and fast uh, daily sales updated data right so this is the sub, uh, body of the email now email is perfect we have uh, written the email uh, now click on the show advance option actually we have to named our file as sales data but we have to ensure that we must apply our format that is cs csv so that it should recognize the format and we should add here timestamp as well because whenever we send a trigger it adds a time stamp like uh, last time when the last time uh, data was sent to an email right just click on save I just put here attachment name times up and dot csv dot csv is the format we must have to put otherwise uh, the file sent over email will not recognize the format because will cause some problem so let's test it again I trigger this okay so now finally you have seen I have received the email with the times up sales data uh, now I can show you a preview because it's recognizing my format so this is exactly the data which I have created in my uh, table right site name and IV, GIV, MSC, FTD and this and all the data comes in the format like this So I hope you enjoyed this session and like the video. So if you like the video, how to create this uh, export this CSV button? Share with your friends and keep subscribe to our channel for upcoming uh, videos related to Power BI.